Hey, here we are. Uh, yeah. Indeed, I can't believe that you've managed to survive till now. Well, it's just normal. Wait, I got a communication. What a troublemaker. A good match for you. Stop joking. Sorry, but I have not been programmed to joke. You really are a funny computer, aren't you? Funny. <laughs> you and that kid Leo are far more of a perfect match. Don't make fun of me. <laughs> They've activated Almon. Let's hurry. Wait. I have to go someplace else first. What? We have no means to resist Anubis trickery. Anubis is far too speedy. Just a moment, I need a function to resist that. But... I'll ask Lloyd for his cooperation. He's a systems engineer for orbital frames. When I was a trainee, he took good care of me. Lloyd? He's an odd fellow. But his skills are supreme. Exactly. It was Lloyd who analyzed the battle strength of Anubis, but... It's good for us, then. Let's ask him to boost Jehuti's programming. You know the place? Ayers Cliff has a lab on the top. He's there, but you can be sure it's heavily protected. I'll guide you. Okay, get in now. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, now. Uh, oh. uh, uh, uh. Sorry about that. Huh? I'm sorry. Hmm. Um. Are you from Marineris? Uh, yes. The northern part, Tharsis. It's far from the canyon. Did you volunteer for this duty? My father was also a soldier. Tharsis. So you were at the Olympus base? Yeah. Hey, why were you in Balrong? Some slogan fooled me into doing it. For the freedom and independence of Mars? It must have been a joke. The reality was just destruction and dictatorship. I often wondered about Noman's orders, though. But I couldn't get out of it until that crisis happened. You mean your final mission? They needed to take the Metatron to a lab on Jupiter, and we were an escort for them. And then? We escorted the Metatron to Antilia Colony. After completing the mission, we were heading back to the camp on Callisto. On the way, we encountered an enormous number of the Space Force. There were so many, they covered the horizon. They ambushed us. In those days, the orbital frame was still in the experimental stage. They were on the latest Earth-built model. We were on Lev's. There was an incredible performance difference between them and us. I asked for immediate reinforcements, but can you imagine how Noman answered me? Just give up, he said. He was smiling at the time. That was the very same Noman who leaked our situation to Earth. He let them ambush us. He killed my pals. He sold out his own unit? A sacrifice. Noman had already taken the Metatron without Earth's permission, so he needed to pretend that the mission had failed. My company had been abandoned. I threw myself wholeheartedly into the battle in order to encourage my pals. I told them reinforcements would arrive soon. When I came to, I realized the Space Force had already gone back. Every single one of my pals was completely destroyed. Some civilian workers in Callisto were killed too. I made up my mind not to return to Baram again. Ever. 
Didn't you want to avenge the deaths of your pals? What could I have done? You could have returned to Bahram and risen in revolt. If you did, everyone would have been on your side. Noman had been trying to kill me. If I did go back, he would kill me. Actually, that's what happened. But... You saw it, didn't you? Even knowing Bahram was wrong, you still agreed to work for Noman? Use power for the right things. At least for the things that you believe in. <laughs> so who's second hand? Huh? It's not easy, is it? But I'm... Forget it. Let's talk about it after all our work is done. But... We have no time, right? Around Lloyd's lab, there are some fixed rapid-fire weapons to prevent invasion. You must advance while steering...